Hello guys, this is uh, another explanation and it is about the shotgun. So in this case we have down down forward one, which is not easy for uh, some players, but uh, it's uh, just a matter of practice. So you can have down down forward one, which is minus six on block, and down down forward one, two. Uh, the second hit can be delayed actually you have a lot of time there is a window in which you can um, confirm the second hit on counter because if you have a, a counter hit it's uh, just a combo but uh, to learn if it's if the first hits counter it uh, and uh, see it so you can have the second hit it's not easy so you have to practice a lot uh, the thing is that you have to imagine uh, and to before doing down the pool one two, just think about your opponent. For example, in this case, you don't have a great punishment as a 14 frames because this is minus 14. But uh, um, for example, against uh, geese, you have um, a launcher. So I just. Uh, show you this is just one of the one of the characters uh who punish well this who punish this move well so it's just a matter of how punishment let's see let's see so it's uh, so this could be very very painful uh and um you you just uh, don't do it unless it's like uh, once in a lifetime but uh, you have to be careful with certain characters then what else so the after down down forward one you can have the wind roll so wind roll is uh, can be done with uh, down down forward one four or three and uh, it's a very very good thing but you have to learn and th this is the hard part you have to learn if the first hit if down down for one has hit or not if you learn to do that it's great because uh, i'll just show you something so if i do my favorite move is down down for one uh, four one so you have it is zero on block for example if devil jim wants to interrupt it he can try flash but what about down for one it's a trade so you can get a combo so it's uh down for one down for two you have other options but it's up to you and the habits of your opponent actually you can have a let me try a block but if you if you take uh, uh, if you hit your opponent with the down of one it's a bit different because in this case there are he actually can't do interruption with the flash as well because you have a uh, more advantage it is not sidesteppable anyway if you are hit but uh, it is somehow if you uh, if devil jim blocks the first down of over one so he can sidestep the second hit there are special uh, special things but uh, an important thing is that uh, it's not easy to crouch and punish if you're not fast enough so you have to do it very precisely yeah i'm not the best with devil gene but uh, you have to be ready for that and since there are lots of options uh it's not easy for him to just uh, duck in west ending too so you can just stop so a good idea 
can be just uh, to to down on for one into roll and see what's happening or you can uh, for example if you do down down forward one into low parry because there's a you know a way in which he can interrupt the um, the role um that's that's another good idea so it's a matter of uh, um habits and uh, seeing of course what's happening you know there are other options you know this can get you uh can give you advantage and it's safe you know this one can be useful sometimes at the wall but uh it's uh it's uh, it's punishable uh you can see of course frame data and uh, the low is uh yeah you can have a balcony break like here but it's really uh punishable so you have to watch out that's why the best probably it's is a uh, dandan for one for one last thing last thing is uh, uh the way that um we have special characters or different characters simply different characters. so a different character yeah devil jean mishimas okay it's uh, just a category of characters but we can have for example characters with the magic four just an example just an example so you have to lab these characters and remember what i am doing against uh which character example if you have if your opponent has magic four just uh, have to watch out unless you crouch and punish if they always do that so it all um, comes to the habits of course so this is really really important um last thing i want to tell you actually there are a lot but uh, let me show you other characters have special parries in that case you have to remember what character and uh, once again you have to uh, remember what parry uh, or what parries you're about to face these situations are really changeable so for example Leroy is very particular because uh, if you try to do down down forward one uh, and uh, and the follow-ups you are bound to get some kind of parries and uh, let me show you it's just just an example so for example this uh, So the question is if you also if you are hit by the number one so some characters have really special parries geese is another of these characters because he can parry the high the mid so the number one for one or two and that's painful uh not a good matchup really uh against geese um last example is the very special example you know about the flash so the flash is back one plus four and uh, i'll just do the fastest example so if you block down of over one if you are if you hit yoshi with down of over one so it's the same in this case you just uh, wait and then if you see the flash you punish and that's it 
uh, the special thing you may don't know is that um, if Yoshi removes the sword it's not uh, he doesn't care if you do the down of four one into the follow up so it's I just do this and block let me show you he can have the parry anyway and juggle you so it's a special case this is the case no sword has got the special parry let me show you again so you have a parry in any case and uh, that's really really painful thank you guys for following me and uh, you know uh, you can follow me at the, on twitch uh, my nickname is boat 78 so thank you guys and see you in the next tutorial